for state. Now, the executive secretary of the Nigerian Shippers Council, Mr. Payo Sakuta, has underscored the crucial role of inland dry ports in reducing trade costs and promoting Nigeria's trade balance. Mr. Okuta made this declaration after conducting an on the spot inspection of the Funtua Inland Dry Port project in Castina State. Ifunaya is a report. As the Funtua Inland Dry Port project nears completion, a two week deadline has been set for necessary adjustments with emphasis on the economic impact on Nigeria's gross domestic product. Joined by the representative of the Minister of Marine and Blue Economy and other dignitaries, the Nigerian Shippers Council Executive Secretary, Mr. Pius Akuta, aligned the Council's effort with the Ministry's 2024 Key Performance Index. He underscored the significance of Nigerian citizens actively participating in the protection and maintenance of vital infrastructures. This for Nigeria means that we are getting set to take uh, the ports closer to shippers in the hinterlands so that it will encourage a uh, free flow of uh, export and that is what Mr. President uh, has uh, put as one of his agenda to improve uh, export out of Nigeria and to balance uh, trade. It enable uh, economy to grow and also create a lot of employment for people around that so that our, in terms of ports will not be domiciled in the south around the, the, the wet port but now with the uh, dry port economy can grow, employment can be uh, increased, and trade uh, can flourish. Puntua as a town, as part of Kazana, is our industrial and commercial hub. Uh, there are a lot of activities, and we are sure that this will serve as a gateway to other destinations, to other worlds. Responding to the development, Mr. Ahmed Dodo, the port director of Funtua Inland Dry Port, pledged improvements to the project. In terms of looking at the timeline that we have been given two weeks, I would take some of the issues so that I would just be saying, okay, we can do this, we cannot do this, yeah. you know, so that uh, it's clear. We can do pavement, we can do filling with laterite between 10, uh, 5 to 10 meters, 5 to 10 centimeters, sorry. So that is something we can do. The Nigerian Shippers Council is actively working on the development of inland dry port projects nationwide, aiming to bring shipping facilities closer to shippers in the hinterlands. Ifunanya Eze, TVC News.